Serious, which one is? How is your boy? <laughs> Baby, you know I am not ready. When I am, I'll just set the wedding date and let him know. So, what's up with your trip? Yes, is your management still sending you? Oh, that's fine. To where? Okay, then we can hook up. My company will be sending me to UK for a week and Dubai for 10 days. Yes, all in August. <laughs> Babe, stop this joke, Jerry. <laughs> it's not my fault, and the best I can find. I didn't have company. We were out to nothing. Hey, babe, put your leg down. You know I don't like that. Hey, <laughs> Yeah, what's up? I think we have something coming up. Can you come, please? Uh, what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Am I married? Is there anything wrong with it? I have told you to discard this clothes. Oh, babe, come on. It's nice and I like it. So what happened to all the clothes I bought for you last week? What are you reserving them for? I'm just going to see Eric. Well, it doesn't matter. That doesn't mean you should dress anyhow. Baby. Don't you know you're not just representing yourself? You are also representing me. Okay? But you're not wearing this. Um, let's see. This should be fine. Okay. That means you still have money from the one I gave you yesterday. Yes. Honey, if you need more money, do not hesitate to tell me, okay? Yeah. I love you. I love you too. All right. Make sure you put on your shoes, okay? Tomorrow. No, he has not followed me. 
it to anyone. I've been trying to get him to do that with me. Yes, I'll see him today and I'll discuss it. Because, mommy, if we have to raise this child and our other kids, we have to do it together. Okay, Ma, thank you. Yes, I'll call you when I finish speaking with him. Okay, Ma. Alison, what is it? You really need to stop sounding like I am disturbing you. What is it? Would it kill you to say, Alison, how are you? How is our child? Or maybe, do you need anything since I am the one stuck in this house raising a baby? Um, Alison, I, I can't do this right now. I, I, I'm, I'm headed for a meeting. I need to be mentally prepared. I just finished speaking with your mother. How many times have I told you not to call my mother? Well, she's the one that called me. And I know you don't want to hear it, but I'm very much family oriented. And it is important to me that I am in speaking terms with your mother and sisters. All right, then that's fine. Go ahead. Keep calling them all you want. Well, I'm already doing that. And you should be grateful for it. I need to see you. Not today, Alyssa. Not today. Today, Yuki. And it's very important. Uh, look, not today. We can talk about this over the phone. No! When can you get here? Um, look, um, uh, I, I'm headed for a meeting, like I said, and I think I'm almost here, okay? You think, or you are there? Do you even know where you are going? I said, um, um, we'll talk later, okay? I'll, I'll see you later. I need to go now. Well, you will not, okay? I need you to come over to this place. We need to talk. And I want you to get me Suya on your way back. With lots of onions. Thank you. Fuck you, fuck you. This What's up, bro? I'm good. How you doing? I'm fine, so... Rafa, now, what's going on? I'm good. So, do you want anything? No, 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 I'm good. What I want to hear now is, you know, us having the opportunity to see them. Yes, we have. But there's a problem. And what is it? You see, this company just got resuscitated. So, they are rebranding. So, they are bringing back a good number of their old product back into the market. That's, That's a good, good thing. What's the problem? But there's a problem here. Which is? They've got a new product manager. Okay, so are we seeing a new product manager? Or I thought we were targeting the managing director? The, pro the problem here is not about we seeing the product manager. And what is the problem? Go straight to the point. Jim doesn't want you. Eric, you know how much I need this. Besides this issue with Jim, but we sorted it out. He said you're not serious. You're not, you're inconsistent and lack of trust. He said that? Yes, he said it and I wouldn't blame him. Come on, Eric, what do you mean by you won't blame him? Look, whatever issue I, 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 I have with, with Jim, he can't hold it over my head forever. Listen, Yuki, you're my friend. You see, you're a very, very talented person. I know that as a friend. But you see the problem here? 
Let me tell you something. Yuki, you are an amazing web developer that's very, very good at VX and VI. But, but look at you. You were sacked from your former job because of your lackadaisical attitude. Okay, look at two years ago. You fought Jim over a woman because of a woman. Look, I am doing my best to live right now. Not my best is the hard way. This issue we are talking about, I have apologized to Jim now. I have. It's not about you fighting Jim over a woman two years ago. The problem here is that he said that you're not, you're not even building for the future. You're not building anything. You're just, you're just there. So in other words, I am useless and can't be trusted. I'm still talking to him. Bro, come and sit down. No, 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 no. I, just, just sit down. I need to go, you know, to avoid you, you know, saying what you don't want to say. What do you know I want to say? That I can't be a part of the team. Listen, you just have to listen to me. I'm still talking to Jim, okay? That's fine. No. You go, V. All right, bro. Where is Zuya Axis get? I'm sorry, I couldn't get it. Why? For goodness sake, I said nobody made Suya at this time of the day. Oh. So I am crazy. Osayuki, you are trying to say that I am crazy for asking you for Suya by this time of the day, isn't it? me now because that's the only thing I, 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 I can get from what you are saying now that I am I am mad for asking you for Suya by this time of the day. Please answer. Did you even try? Did you even make an attempt to see if you can get me Suya? How many places did you go to? How many stores or, or, or Suya spots did you check in an attempt to get me Suya? I am very sure you did not because if you had you would have had something to say. Alison. <sighs> I'm not in the right place to have this conversation. Do you know how upsetting what you just said right now is? Or so you can take a look at me. Do I look like a baby making robots? I am only trying to have a conversation with you and each time you turn everything into an issue. Alison, I beg you. I am not emotionally available for your ranting. Not today. Ranting? What are you kidding me? Ranting? So all of a sudden I am now ranting. When you were turning me into different positions, placing me in different positions in bed, I was not ranting. When you were going in, in and out from me, I was not ranting. When you were telling me, baby, I like it. Baby, set it like this. Baby, do it like baby, sweet. I am enjoying it. I was not ranting. I'm sorry, I'm Am sorry. I asking for too much? I'm, sorry, I'm, I'm just sorry. trying to, 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 to have some connection with you. I am sorry. I mean, if, if not that I care about you, would, would, would I be complaining like this? I am sorry. I am sorry. I'm sorry. You're supposed to be living with me. Your mom agrees with that. Look, I don't want to talk about what my mom agrees with right now. I don't. Well, your mother thinks you're irresponsible. I really don't care what my mother thinks right now. Can we, can we, can we not talk about what my mother thinks, please? Tomorrow is Antinato and you're coming with me. Look, 
I don't want that look. This is your child. I will try. Well, I am sorry. But trying will not cut it. You are coming with me to that hospital whether you like it or not. Uh -uh. Show some form of responsibility for once. Okay, I even told your mom that I will call her when you come because I am very sure that... Okay, it's upstairs. Excuse me. Excuse me now! I'm very sure your mother will not tolerate all these kind of things. Also, you your mother brought you up better than this, or she brought you up better than this. You cannot be treating me like this, like, 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 like I'm a peasant or something. What's this now? You put me in, in, in this condition and all of a sudden you allow me, uh, allowing me to carry, carry the pregnancy over myself. You can't even help me, you can't pamper me, nothing you are doing. Every time you are tired, every time you don't want me to run. Hey, she was even said I ran to court. Hey, me ran. Me, Alison, ran. Do you know what the time is? Well, I had a long and terrible day. What I need right now is rest to cool off. What does that even mean? I'm sorry, babe, but I can't do this right now. Do okay. what? Have a sensible conversation. What do you want from me now? I want you to commit to coming home on time. You know, there are several reasons that would have made me come late, right? You know, you know this, right? Well, you have told me the reason and it's not good enough. You don't have the key to this house. You can't be coming home whenever you like. I am security conscious, you know that. I'm not done talking. What I'm trying to tell you is that I am going through a lot right now. A lot of adults are going through a lot right now. What do you want? No more late night. Fine, no more late night. I'm serious. I'm not laughing. Fine! Tell me you're going to drink that. I will. Baby. What is it? Why are you acting like the weight of the world is on your shoulders? What is going on? Just, um... Some bad news. What is it? An old friend refusing to work with me. Hey, don't worry, baby. Other opportunities will come, okay? You know I got you always. Hmm? Okay, don't worry. I have something for you. For my baby. Okay? Uh. Okay. Have this. for your expenses. All right, darling. Okay, thank you. Mm. Do have a great day. And please, stop drinking this cheap stuff. Thank you. 
Guy, what's up? Uh, yeah, Guy, what's up? Uh, yeah, I'm just leaving a meeting with Jim. We talked about you. Yeah, he's still at the mount, but I'm putting my weight behind you. Guy, listen. If you mess up things this time, I will never forgive you. Should you really be doing that? Do you want this work or not? Do. Desperately. Where I'm at right now, guy, I feel worthless. Then go to work. I'm sending you an email immediately. It's their brief. Yeah, so send me more cops, uh, wireframes of the site. Then everything, yeah. All right, I'm on it. Listen to me. I need this today. Don't joke with that. I am on it. Okay, see you around. Yeah, bye. Hello, mom. Look, I'm working right now and you yeah, what? What? When? Okay, okay, I'll I'll call her now. I'll I'll call her now. I'll call her now. I like this now. to tell her that you can't breathe? That's because that's the way I was feeling at the time. And now that you're feeling better, did you pick up the phone to tell her so that she could calm her nerves down because she's out there panicking? Oh, Sayuki. Well, if you haven't noticed, I am pregnant. These feelings come to me. I am not in control of them. That is the reason why you shouldn't leave a pregnant woman alone. Do you have an idea of what you pulled me out from? Does it look like I care? Look, I am trying to get your attention. I get lonely here too. But you have refused any of my siblings coming here to help you. That is because your siblings did not get me pregnant. You did. It is you I want here, not them. Anyways, I want you to spend the night with me. Osayuki, don't walk out that door. I said don't walk out that... Why are you so irresponsible? to, you know, clear my head, come up with better designs and, you know,
Yes, no. Now is not a good time. Okay? Mm -hmm. I was thinking about your old trip today. Okay, that would be. Look, I have to deliver on this. Else, everything Eric has done for me would be in vain. Okay? No, but you can do that later. Mm -hmm. Babe, no. Look, I have to be done in a couple of hours so I can meet presentation tomorrow. Okay? Baby, you had all day. No, no, I didn't. I had to go see Alison. I didn't have time to work. You went to see Alison? Yes, she called my mother and my mother called me panicking. Alison now talks to your mother. I don't encourage it, okay? And you didn't do anything about it? What was I supposed to do about it? How did she get your mother's number? She took it from my phone without asking. Oh, so your whole family now talks to Alison? She's pregnant with my child. Of course, every member of my family, they know. They know already. You know, you're very stupid to say what you just said. What did I just say? She's pregnant with your child. Is she supposed to be pregnant with your child? We quarreled for a few months and what you did was to get some girl pregnant. I thought we've gone over this conversation. Again. Not when you go to her every time and not make out time for me. <laughs> don't touch me! Be, don't be bad. Scarlet. She's having my child. Yes, mom, she's having my son. I know that. But, but you need to stop this thing. It's because she's using you to get to me. I know I have said I am going to take care of my child and I will do that. I will not shy away from my responsibilities. But no, stop it. But if I stop calling you, don't blame me. Don't blame me. Please stop letting her use you to get to me now. Yeah, guy, what's up? Yeah, I was just called in to have a meeting with the project manager. Yeah, I was supposed to submit uh, the profile of the team, but they asked me to come in. Yeah. No, 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 no. Jim couldn't make it. Yeah. Yeah, because it's a good one. Yeah, because your profile, I have to submit the one, the one you sent last night and the work, everything. Thank you, Eric. Thank you so much. You've always had me. Ah, it's okay. Come on. What are friends for? Just pray it works. Yeah, because I've been on this for a very long time, so I need this to work. I understand. I'm sorry about last night. Okay, okay. All right. Okay, I'll get back to you. Oh, yeah. All right, see you around, okay? Okay. Ma, your 10 a.m. appointment is here. Please send him in. Okay, Ma. Good morning, Eric. Thanks for seeing me. Um, thanks for coming on such a short notice. You're welcome. Yeah. So, sorry, may I? Yeah, please sit. Thank you. Wow. Um, 
I knew you were supposed to send in your profile. Yes. Yeah, I work better knowing who I'm working with. It's fine with me. Okay. If we're looking at setting up a small products design team, what should we be looking at? Uh, let's say a two or three UI US designers that will take care of the product structures and how it works. Then if we're looking at a large team? Then we're talking about an interaction designer, copywriter, data strategies, audio designer, and the rest of it. Great. We're looking at setting up together a small and large team, and we'll put everything you've sent in into consideration. It's okay. It's important I mention that we'll restructure the team ourselves. Ah, uh, so that means the people I come with might not be the people I work with? Yes, which means that some people will be dropped. Ah, uh, okay, I, I understand. Okay. I have one question. Okay. <laughs> no, girl, that is not even my point. My point is, if he's talking about taking care of the girl that is pregnant for him, what exactly does he mean by that? Are you telling me that after investing in him, he will just move on with another girl just because she's pregnant for him? It, that is what I'm saying. I need to hear it loud and clear. Okay? I mean, she's already talking to the whole family, acting like the wife, when I'm the one he lives with. <laughs> Babe, I'm tired. Okay? It's fine. I'll, I'll talk to you later. I'm almost home. Let me just get this whole thing over with. I'll call you back. All right, dear. Bye. Just excuse. Why is this man blocking the room like this? See no more. Welcome, dear. Sit, we need to talk. Okay. <sighs> what is going on with your baby mama? I don't understand. When we got back together, you told me about her. And I asked you specifically what kind of relationship you want with her. And I told you the relationship was going to be cordial so that we can raise our child together. Even though I was sad that she was even in the picture, I accepted it. And I am most grateful for that. I will forever be. Should I be concerned now? No. I am not in a relationship with Alison. I am not. I was just hoping we could be friends for the sake of the child. That's all. Yet I heard you talking to your mother about her. It was rubbing on my conversation. I wasn't. I was just passing by and I heard you. I just want to know where we are. Scarlett, you are still my girlfriend. Hey. Come here. If I decide to take this to the next level, will you be ready? I, I need to be able to take care of you, you know that, right? I can take care of us.
Sorry. It's Eric, I need to take this. We are having a serious conversation. This is important. You'll call him back later. Okay? What do you want me to say? I want you to assure me that everything I am doing for you is not in vain. Everything okay? Everything's fine. Uh, what's up? I'm sensing that Jim has got into the new product manager. And why do you sense this? Yeah, because the woman told me that they are planning on reshuffling. I thought they were hiring teams. Yeah, she said they are reshuffling. Now that means that they are the one to create the teams. Then that means the arrangement of agreement has changed. I mean, if the iron loss is an establishment that's outsourcing to them, we are supposed to be responsible for putting together the team. True, but this time they are hiring everyone directly. Meaning some people will be dropped to avoid replicating positions, right? Exactly my point. Let me guess, I, I might be affected. My brother. I couldn't shake off the feeling that Jim was behind all this. So what do I do? Because it's like I've been blacklisted everywhere. I really need to break out of this mess I'm in. Do you know what? Go back to the brief I gave to you. Create as many designs as you can. Keep it handy. I'll get back to you. Thank you so much, Eric. It's okay. Thank you for always coming through. It's alright. I, I, I really appreciate it's you. It's okay. Anything for a friend. Thank you. Please, just keep it handy, okay? Wants me to come over to his place. Mm -hmm. We have a project we need to work on together. We have to deliver in due time, so it's important that we work all night. God forbid I'll be the one to stop you from succeeding in life. You didn't tell me you were coming. I'm sorry, I had to come. <laughs> Did you come here to work? I came to see you, you know, but I have work to deliver in the morning, so I brought it with me. Oh. Yeah. 
Is there a problem? No. Okay. I, I need to get to this. So, did you come to work or to see me? Listen, I just told you. I came to see you, but I brought work with me. So which one is priority? Seeing you, of course. Good. Opie, you know you can move in if you want to, right? Money is not a problem. Yeah, I know. You know your dad has money, but I'm not moving in with you. Don't say it like that. You know what? My feet hurt. Can you please massage it for me? Don't give me that look. You can be massaging it and be working now. Okay. You're not touching it. Come on, just one second. It's past the second. This one here. Babe? Baby? What's that you keep? Where exactly are you coming from? Excuse me? I called Eric. As much as he wanted to cover up for you, he didn't know what to say. Why would you call him? I live in this house with you. And you will go to another woman's house and lie to me about it. You left me with no choice. No, you had a gun put to your head to lie to me. I needed to work and you were not letting me. I wanted to have a discussion. No, you wanted me to commit to something I wasn't ready for. What do you need to get ready for? We already live in this house as man and wife. What else do you want? Listen to me. I just need you to do the right thing. Okay? Have a nice day. I also. Wait. He said that. He wants me to be on the team. Okay, okay. Oh, thank you so much. This is great news. Um, no problem, no problem. I'll be with you shortly. <laughs> All right. Sissy, I'm not posting your brother. It's just that I'm not ready for all this right now. I'm just focused on this company. That's all that matters. Ma, what there are it? gentlemen outside waiting to see you. Bring them in. Okay, Ma. Um, Sissy, I have a meeting now. I have to talk to you later, okay? Good morning, Eric. I know Sayuki. Good morning, Eda. Oh, Sayuki, it's been a while. Sit down, gentlemen. It's good to see you. Uh, 
I needed to have um, this brief meeting before I do my final presentation to the management. Osayuki. Yes. Eric said you're good with the UI UX design. So if you're to advise on three key things the UI UX designers should focus on, what should it be? <clears throat> um, yes, um... Guy, what happened in there? Who is she? My ex fiance Same girl you left days before the wedding? Yes. Ah, you okay. Something is wrong somewhere. You have a girl who you implemented a month after meeting her. You are living with a babe who is ready to run your life. Then the project you've been running on, been working on for months, is in the hands of your cheated ex fiance Bro, I don't want to lose this. Whatever you have to do, you have to do it now. And I have no idea that she had a connection with this. I would have stayed away. That's fine. Let's go. Oh, I'll take a cab. Suit yourself. I've lingered far too long in a place where all my flaws and my weakness got the very best of me. I know I screwed things up, but I wanna right or wrong. I cannot deny that I've been. Caught up in the mess I made Everybody knows that I I'm so flawed I can't deny It's all my fault you can put the blames on me All those times when I should have Done things differently Why do you take things for granted? What happened to the one that came? Why didn't you take advantage of it? Because I don't feel like it. I don't, I don't want you to You keep work these with them. people work so hard on this project. And you think you can just turn your back on them just because you feel like it? What makes you think they can trust you ever again? Others will, okay? You get things so easily. People warming up to you, handing you things without asking for anything in return. And you feel it will always be so. It will always be so, okay? There will be more opportunities. Because you are the only talented person in this city. You can listen. You are talented, no doubt. But talent is never enough. Very soon, nobody will care that much. And you've been looking for opportunities, you won't find any. It's not going to get to that, okay? I've got this. Done things differently. I took them for granted. Now I'm wishing that I read the
before we talk. What is it? I... I need to be free with what I want to say. I promise not to take much of your time. Okay. Scarlett, I... I know I've not been living up to my duties in this relationship. I cannot pretend anymore that I don't know what I'm supposed to do. You are a very kind-hearted person. And you've been good to me for, for a long, long while now. Are you breaking up with me? No. But I'm moving out. Moving out? Move to where? You have no money. Yes, I don't. But I will find it. I'm just tired of being dependent on you. You sound like I am frustrating you. You're pushing me to doing the right thing. That's how I sound. What does that even mean? Scarlett, I don't want you to give me money anymore. Consider me a visitor for the next couple of weeks. You're moving out in a few weeks? I'll move out in less if I can. Then what happens to our relationship? You can't just move out like that. We have invested a lot in this relationship. We both need to be sure we want forever in this deal. And how do you know what I want? What I do for you, I don't do it for anyone else. Does that not say something to you? And honestly, I appreciate. Um, I've never told you this. I once walked out on my fiance days before I went. Trust me, you don't want to pressure a guy who can do that and is still in a confused state to be with you. You don't. Good morning, you came. Oh, good morning, Elak. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I won't take much of your time. I, I came to see you um, concerning Eric and the rest of the team. I don't think I understand what you mean. I, I know I hurt you in the past. Okay? And I'm really sorry for it, but I was just hoping you won't let that affect you know, Eric and the other members of the team. You think I'll make decision based on what happened between us? I was honestly hoping you wouldn't. I didn't come this far by being vengeful or blinded by emotions. I'm a very objective person and I have made my recommendation. And we'll see where it goes from there. I have a meeting I need to join. Okay, um, I, I will be on my way. Yes, mommy, I totally agree with you. Of course. Open! Open! Yes, ma. Mommy, he's even here. 
Okay, Ma. Mommy wants to talk to you. Mama. Honey, I'll have to call you back. Alison and I have something to talk about. All right, Mom. Don't look at me like that. She's the one that called me. We need to talk. What's going on? Alison, I need you to see things the way they are. And how are things? We're having a baby. Well, of course I know that. We're not getting married. I didn't say we were. Why don't you call my family, hoping that it's going to happen? And why are you so sure it isn't? As of now, where I stand, I am sure it's not going to happen, so, yes. So it can happen? I would rather we, we leave that aside and wait for it to happen before, you know, acting on it. Why are we having this conversation? As in, I am trying to get my life back together. And I'm making sure everybody that's a part of it is on the same page with me. I need us to do things properly, considering the current situation. So we handle this together as friends, having a baby together. Is your girlfriend the reason you are telling me this? No, no. However, I ran into someone that reminded me of how wrongly I handled things in the past. feeling they're going to call you back. You don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> it's okay. Uh -huh. I've lingered far too long. <laughs> guy, 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 you need to stop. 
I've warned you several times. Don't be coming at me with this kind of offers. No. It's too small. Stop it. We've had this conversation before. I told you. Big fishes only. Okay? Taking this game to the next level. I can't be doing small fries. Big, big. Get off my phone, Joe. I know that look. You're upset. It's a baby. You, you don't want people to be insulting me. Now. That's the oh. point. They are not insulting you. They only brought a project for you to design for them. And then they're pricing me like peanuts. No, no. You should have just said no and encouraged them to come back when they have your budget. In other words, I should kiss ass. No. In other words, don't burn bridges. Because very soon, nobody's going to call or recommend you. That's not going to happen. I've got this. That's <laughs> what you keep saying. No, but come on. You know me now. It's me. Now I'm the best at this. Yeah. Do you think opportunities will always come? They will always, always come. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cheryl, oh, no, what's your... Uh-uh, what's your... <laughs> What's yo? <laughs> hey, we hey. Good to see you. Same here. Get that for you. Do you want anything? No, not yet. Okay. Um, I called you here because it's important for me to let you know that the team Eric presented was not picked. But then, Eric and most of the people in the team have been picked individually. And I wasn't? Yes. Uh, truth is, um, Eric getting picked is good enough for me. Yes. Yuki, you weren't picked because someone in the team, the management set up to approve our recommendation, dropped you. <sighs> Must be someone I crossed in the past, I guess. Maybe. How have you been? Mm -hmm. um, paying for everything I did wrong in the past, I guess. Uh, you know, let me chase this opportunity to apologize for everything I did. Please, to let's you. not talk about personal stuff and get to the reason I'm here. Right. If you can deliver this brief, maybe, just maybe, there might be an opportunity opening up somewhere for you. Is this from your company? No. A friend's company. It's more, but it's a good start. You can start here to make things right. Start building the bridges you want. Very soon the industry will hear about your comeback. No, no, it's fine, it's fine. I wouldn't have forgiven myself if you didn't get picked, honestly. I wouldn't have, no, no. Uh, 
Oh, no, it's fine. Um, so, I've got this um, thing I need to work on and I'll be needing a loan. A small loan, if you don't mind. Okay, I'll text it to you. Thank you very much. What you told me got me thinking. I know I may have come off as harsh, sometimes irrational, but I want you to know that I love you so much and I don't want you to move out. But if you insist, I can get you an apartment. Mm. I don't want you to get me an apartment. I'll get one for myself. Okay, fine. Can I move in? I'm not sure. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I'm only being sincere. Are you moving in with Alison? No, I'm not. Scarlett, I need to pick up a few things. I have a project I need to start and um, I'll be needing to check into a hotel. Excuse me, please. I offer. I'm okay. I'm on it right now. Yeah, I'll be making a presentation to her later today. Well, from what I know about her, she doesn't mess about with work. Yes, she doesn't. So if I'm going to keep that channel open, I must be at my very best. Yes, no problem. I'll keep you posted. Um, if you look through pages two to seven, you will see the wireframe. That's how I intend the layout for the site to be. However, I'm not um, using the complex color and fonts as I don't have it. They are very specific about their colors and fonts. And I'll have them send it to you. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, and, and structuring the internet marketing. I'm proposing we look into the um, email marketing, um, pay-per-click, blogging, and of course social media marketing. The objectives are outlined here. Um, I'm looking at um, sales revenue, profit margin, product type, sales leads, and of um, course web visitors. I also have a sample of the KPI dashboard, which will be showing um, weekly visits, bounce rates, and um, of course um, traffic source. I can see it. SEO. No, it's in there too, um, a detailed approach to the SEO. Great. I have seen the soft copy you emailed. I will get back to you and see if they are as impressed as I am. Thank you. You're welcome. Hello, are you okay? Yes, where are you? I'm just returning from a presentation. Our child has been kicking and you don't even get to witness any of it. I, mean, I feel like you're just leaving me all alone to handle this thing by myself. It's not fair. Um, 
Yeah. The next time you're going to the hospital, I'll come with you. And I can witness all the kicking possible. We should. Um, I will let you know when the next appointment with the doctor is. Yeah. It's our baby. We should do this together. Uh, okay, take care. Okay. You too. Bye, love. Coming back home soon. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Baby, don't understand. I need to know what to do and act fast. I feel like he's slipping away. If he moves out of this house, then I have nothing on him. And I can't get pregnant for him. I'll become one of his baby mamas. Mm, I don't know about any other woman other than Alison. And he never agrees that there's something going on between them. Baby's fine. Let me allow you sleep. Okay. Yeah, good night. Hello? You are not for long because I have um, work to do. And I have to submit it tomorrow. I got another email to come tomorrow. No, I told him. Where else would I be? Mm, I'm not sure yet. Um, it depends on a couple of things when I finish this. And I didn't want any form of distraction. Um, you know what, can we... Can we talk later? I really need to finish work. Okay. Sorry for keeping you waiting. No, it's fine. I got good news from my friends. It seems everyone is impressed with you. Oh, okay. They are going to be releasing 70% and of course 30% when you're done with the project. Oh, that's, that's great. Thank you so much. I, I can't thank you enough for this. I, I'm, I'm grateful. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, retaining the client is solely up to you. Yes, sir. I will do everything within my power to make sure I retain them and every other person I work with. Now, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you, Bob. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I, I don't mean to be inappropriate. Or, uh, I don't know if you mind me taking you out to dinner. Please, it will, it will mean a lot for all time. Sake. Sure. Just send me the address. Uh, you're welcome. Have a lovely day. Hi. 
Alright. You see? Thank you. You look really good. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, hope you don't mind I took the liberty to place the order for both of us. No, it's not a problem. I suppose I ordered your favor. <laughs> Thank you. But, um, um, you know what, I'm just going to jump right into it because uh, I can't Yeah, um, I was saying that, um, you know, I, I've had to learn life's lessons the hard way. When I, I lost my job, started a company of my own and couldn't sustain it. I got broke and had to move in with my girlfriend. I don't even know if I could call my girlfriend because we might, might have broken up. Everything is all messed up. I'm expecting a child from a woman I barely even know. But you would think all this would, would rattle me, but no. The one regret I have was not listening to you. Because if I did, life wouldn't have turned out so tough. Well, maybe that was what was needed to get you to become the person you are right now. I don't know how easy it is for you to, you know, Forgive me. Uh, I am sorry and I cannot say that enough. I had to tell myself the truth. You were not ready. And thank God we didn't force anything. I've healed and moved on. Thank you. You have been very kind to me. Very kind to me. Uh, I haven't been in this position in life in a long while because for most of it after I left, I have been helpless. More useless if I'm being frank. So it's, so, it's so good to be here right now to, to feel alive again. You used to say a lot of things to me, and one of them was if I take things for granted, the things that are granted to me will be taken. I remember seeing that a couple of times. Um, like, a lot was taken from me. And now you are helping me get things back. Just... Yeah. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> You're a different person. And I'm pleasantly surprised. You didn't used to take things seriously. You never showed appreciation for anything done for you. Uh, seeing the details you show in your work and how you show appreciation, it's, it's really amazing. So, can we eat now? Oh, yes, sure.
Oh, do, do you want a drink? I'm not with this one. my man <laughs> see how happy you look bro <laughs> well you have no idea <laughs> thank you it's like i've just been let out of a cage <laughs> congratulations bro thank you, thank you. at least i'm happy you're back into the scene please make use of it i will i will i intend to <laughs> i intend to but, um, i i really have to thank you you know if not for you i wouldn't have had the the chance to meet with Edak again, let alone the opportunity to get into the system. It's I'm right. really grateful. Okay. Anything for my mom, bro. Let's go now. Alright. <laughs> oh. Hi, Scarlett. Is he here? Who? <laughs> you obviously know who I'm talking about. <laughs> Where will you keep it here? I want to know the new house you took my boyfriend to. Of course, I took him to the new house. Where? Scarlett, what are you doing? What do you mean by what am I doing? I want you to take me to my boyfriend's house. And you want me to take you there? Of course. Why don't you just ask him? And what makes you think I've not done that already? <sighs> Listen, Scarlett. If Yuki has not told you where he's staying right now, just calm down. Trust me, he will tell you as soon as he's ready to. Does that even make sense to you? Right now, I don't know what makes sense and what doesn't make sense. Because really, I don't know what happened between the both of you. Mm -hmm. What happened is my boyfriend of two years recently just moved out of the house uh, because he got one job that has given him one chicken money like that. Scarlett, why don't you just call Yuki yourself? Call him. <laughs> you know what? I deserve better. I deserve better from all of this. I, uh, you know something, I really just, don't... Just shut up. You just... Scarlet... Okay, no problem. I called you here to let you know that the management picked you to head the team. 
And there's a brief waiting for you already. Thank you so much. Wow, this is this is amazing. This is exactly what I need. I'm so so grateful and I promise I am going to do my best. I'll give it my best, like I, I assure you. I'll appreciate that. I will not want anything less. The management saw your previous job and they were impressed. So happy, thank you. I won't let you down, I promise. Uh, thank you. Congratulations once again. Thank you. You know, I'm, I'm, I don't know, despite our history, you're still able to help me like this. I, I just want you to know that I am most grateful and I will not take it for granted. Thank you. You're welcome. Jim is really preaching your gospel, and trust me, I'm getting jealous about it. I had a meeting with him a couple weeks ago, and I realized there and then that we won't have crutches anymore. Ha. Bro, your phone has been ringing for so long. Pick the call and make the person rest now. Person. Person have big people. Uh, is it two of them? Yes. So what are you going to do now? I've been thinking about it. UK. The best advice I can give you as a friend. You see, the best advice I can give you as a friend is whatever you do, they clutter your life. Choose in between them who becomes your woman and stick to the person. Define what you have with them. <laughs> Trust me, you obviously know who your heart beats for. I do. Then talk to the person and simplify your life by being clear. <sighs> you see? <laughs> the call is coming again. And they wait for you to make you finish. Excuse me. Um, hello, Scarlett. I'm sorry. I'm not shutting you out. I'm not. I'm not hiding anything. Um, you, you need to hold on. I'll call you right back. I, I need to take this call. All right, I will send you the address, okay? Hello, Alison. Well, Sayuki, so you moved into a new apartment for weeks now. And you did not think to let me know, Abi. You did not even bother to send me the address. It's not that. I just got really busy. You've been very busy. Or maybe you just did not want to send it at all, Abi. Because if your sister had not told me, I wouldn't have found out. All right, Alison, I will send you the address. Please send it. Your son will be grateful. Ah, your son needs to know his father now. Guy, you cannot preserve your life by complicating it all. Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> okay, I'm watching. <laughs> Here. Um, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. And so how is your team doing? Great. We just um, sent designs to 
the subsidiaries. Yeah. Yeah, I saw some beautiful layouts. Thank you, ma'am. I'm really glad to like. Thank you so much. Welcome. Um, I guess I'll be on my way now. All right. Um, Anna. So I, I told you I was looking for a place, right? I, I finally got one, and I moved in. Okay. So I was wondering if you would, you know, like to stop by sometime, catch up. <laughs> I'll send you the address. I decided since it's Saturday, I should just pay you a visit. Thank you. You're welcome, ma'am. I'm thankful you decided to, you know, visit. I'm really happy. Uh, what can I offer you? Nothing for now. You sure? Mm-hmm. You're staring. I'm sorry, I can't help it. I never thought I was going to see you again. But here you are. Out. Obviously, this would you know, continue and I'll continue seeing you. Our project will last forever. I wasn't talking about projects. Scarlet, I, I messed up big time in the past, I know. And I do not have any right to ask for a second chance. But someone once said to me that what the hearts beat for it like, is I know what you want, and I won't go through that with you again. That I am not that person anymore. I count myself the luckiest man on earth to have you here in front of me. And I'm not going to take that for granted. But what I want is the opportunity to show you and prove to you that I have truly changed. That's all I'm asking for. What's going on here? I thought you invited me here so that we can have a conversation about us. I could discuss. I haven't come back to you. Shouldn't that tell you something? Bullshit! I rant nonsense! After all this time that we have been together, Living together like man and wife. I don't get it. I have done everything for you because I, I was saving for our future. Now I walk in here and you're telling me that you have moved on. I don't understand. What do you mean by that? How dare you? You need to stop raising. Don't tell me to stop raising my voice. What is wrong with you? What's are you P? Why is this your house even so difficult to locate? What's going on here? Oh, 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 oh. So this is the reason you've been clamoring to get your own place. So 
you can turn it into a brothel. I, why am I even surprised? Even your mother said it that you are irresponsible. No, don't say that. I am not irresponsible, okay? We've talked about this countless times. I will take full responsibility for my child. And that's it. Wait, what? No, answer me. Wait, what, Sosayuki? Your peanut pain of a job? Is that it? Osayuki, have I ever asked you for anything? Have I asked you for money before? Do you even know the price of milk in the market? Enough, okay? Enough of this nonsense! Scarlet. What? I'm most grateful for everything you have done for me. But I am sorry, Scarlet. You were not good enough for me. No, I will never say that to you. Why would you want to be with someone who doesn't want to be with you? Why would you not want to be with someone who has done everything for you? Because he is ungrateful. Alison. This is the point. A relationship is not a transaction. It is not trade by butter. You are very ungrateful. I see she's the one you have chosen. Good luck to that. There are a thousand and one men out there. And make sure you return everything I bought for you. And you excuse me if I kick this baby out of your tummy. Ah. It's yours. What's paying this one? Is it the breakup or the fact that you were not able to give him a child? <clears throat> Chosen one. I hope you know how to babysit. Because a baby, boy, is coming. And me, and this one's mother here, we've chosen a name for him. Osayuki, you will hear from me and your mother. Because the way you are treating me is not fair. It's not fair! I'm calling your mother. So sorry. I am so sorry. So sorry. Asayuki, your life is just getting back on track. You need time for yourself to truly elevate and find. For what is worth, I will always be here. You can count on me. You do know I'm not going to give up on you. I know. See you at work. Second.
<sighs> this one here. Thank you very much. Cause it's time to be a better man. Yeah. I lost it all thanks to my ego. I hope this time I can make it right. Cause I stepped away too many toes. Now I'm dealing with so many foes. Yeah. Oh.